In number 113, in your class work for quadratic equations, asks which equation has two real solutions? Uh, so this is going to be based off of this, the discriminant. So we know when the discriminant is greater than zero, we get two real roots, which means we have two real solutions. So we're just going to look at uh, the discriminant in each scenario, which is going to be b squared minus 4ac. So uh, in each equation, we're going to rewrite it in standard form. So the first one is already written in standard form. And then the second would be 2x squared minus 16x plus 32 equals 0. And the second would be, uh, since we have 5x on both sides, we can subtract 5x out. So we'll have 2x squared minus 18 equals 0. And in the last one, we'll have uh, 3x squared, and subtracting 2x from both sides, we'll have plus 5x, then adding 9, we have plus 9 equals 0. So taking a look at uh, which one will have a positive discriminant. So we know that this uh, b squared term is always going to be 0 uh, in any case, uh, whether b is negative or positive because uh, when we square a negative number, uh, it turns out to be positive in the end. So we're going to look at um, this uh, negative uh, 4 times AC term a little closer. So um, this uh, uh, scenario C uh, interests me a little bit because we don't have a B term. So then we're just going to look at uh, minus 4ac. So then uh, we know the discriminant for uh, c uh, is going to be uh, b squared, which is 0 squared minus 4 uh, times a, which is 2, times c, which is negative 18, uh, which turns out to be a uh, positive number. Uh, and that uh, positive number is uh, 144. So we know that C will have uh, two real roots. And uh, since we already found which one has two real solutions, uh, we know that that is our uh, answer.